Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Demon Heart Studios. I'm your host, Riddell Demon Heart, and this is DirectX versus Vulcan. First up is the PTU with DirectX 11. I'm going to go down the list and say my feelings about DirectX 11 and Vulcan. So, by all means, sit back, grab yourself a cup of coffee, and enjoy the show. DirectX 11 has a long time the go-to API for Star Citizen, offering stability and familiar performance. With that being said, it's just lagging and needs to go. Enter Vulcan, the new render in Star Citizen promises to enhance efficiency and performance optimization. While DirectX 11 has served Star Citizen well, Vulcan's potential for better scalability and reduced overhead is a game changer. With that, it will provide better scalability, allowing Star Citizen to take advantage of modern gaming systems with multiple CPU cores. This can lead to improved performances on systems with higher core counts. Reduce latency. Vulcan offers lower driver overhead and reduced latency compared to DirectX 11. This can result in more responsive gameplay and reduce input lag. Vulkan is a cross-platform API, meaning it can also run on Linux and Mac OS. This allows Star Citizen to reach wider audiences and ensures consistent performance across different platforms. And in the end, this is basically going to future-proof for now. I hate using the word future-proof, but that's what they say. And adaptable to involving hardware and software technologies, ensuring that the game can take advantage for future advancements. Now, given the gameplay that I have done, I pretty much am agreeing with everything I read with about Vulcan versus DirectX 11. With the minor increase of fps i was basically able to get about 40 fps inside orson originally i usually get about 25 to 30. but i can't just leave direct x alone alone so with the end point in the back end of the video is direct x 11 running natively and no hindrance with any of the ptu drama I brought it I brought some scenery from the PU. As you can see, this is the goal point for Vulcan. Will Vulcan be able to overthrow the DirectX 11 and be better? Only time will tell. But given the how laggy input problems and the gameplay is from just jumping from person from the a US server to the EU server, I'm getting a lot of input lag. But I'm, I can't say I'm still getting lag for Vulcan, but that is just the PTU at the moment. Given with optimization and the backend support, and what Vulcan is just now, basically in less than a week in week one. PTU for backers. Honestly, I got my hopes up for Vulcan, and I hope in the end it becomes better than DirectX 11. Well, that is enough of DirectX 11 versus Vulcan. What are your thoughts on it? Do you think it will over be as good as everybody thinks? Or actually, CIG hopes. I'm Riddell Demonheart, and this is Demonheart Studios. I am part of Frontier Consolidated News Network. Yes, I am going to run with that. Yes, Frontier Consolidated, the one group brought to you by Loud Guns. The man that tells you to sit back and grab a, grab a cup of tea has allowed me to run with Frontier Consolidated as well as add, run it in my videos. So, 
if you want to join an awesome org, yes, an awesome org that enjoys playing with the community. I will post up right here on the video of the tagline to get in. Just make sure to say Riddell sent me and you, you love his videos. Yeah, that'll be great. Other than that, can't wait to see you on the next one. Later.